Hey, my name is Yupin Kumar, and in today's session, we'll focus on Kibana, a Elk Stack Part B. Agenda for today's session is installing and configuring Kibana dashboard, integrated Kibana with Elasticsearch, and Kibana dashboard walkthrough. So, what is the Kibana? Kibana is an open source visualization tool on top of Elasticsearch cluster. User can create bar lines by chart for the elastic search data. Kibana required Java runtime. So let's go ahead and install the Open JDK on the machine. This command going to install Open JDK along with wget. Okay, now go ahead and download the Kibana RPM. I am downloading Kibana 6.2.4 because my other components like Elasticsearch and Logistics are also running under 6.2.4 version. Kibana RPM has been downloaded. Now go ahead and install the Kibana. Kibana has been installed on the machine. Now let's go ahead and add Kibana into the config file so that Kibana can be start automatically when system boot up. Let's go ahead and verify the status of Kibana. Kibana is not running. Let's go ahead and start it. Okay, Kibana has been started. We can verify the Kibana status one more time. Kibana is running. Let's go ahead and verify the Kibana logs. Kibana logs are located under the var folder. Let's check out Kibana sender log file. Now you can see a warning message that unable to retrieve connection from Elasticsearch because we haven't configured the Elasticsearch yet with the Kibana. So now let's go ahead and modify the Kibana.yml file and Add Elasticsearch URL along with couple of the property in the file. So let's modify server.host. I am providing the IP address of this machine. You can provide the host name of this machine. Let's go ahead and modify the port on which Kibana is going to listen. I am okay with default port 5601. Now let's go ahead and configure the Elasticsearch information. Please make sure that your Elasticsearch services is listening on this IP address and port because Kibana is going to talk on this IP address and port number to retrieve the data. Provide the server name if you like it and go ahead and save it. Now let's go ahead and restart the Kibana service. Kibana service has been stopped and started. Kibana is going to listen on this IP address and port 501. These are Elasticsearch indexes. I can access these data into the Kibana dashboard. Let's go ahead and change the time range. And I am changing since 90 days. Now you can see that all the data that is available in Elasticsearch I can access into the Kibana dashboard. You can play around on Kibana dashboard with Elasticsearch data. I am not going to be discover all the features in this video. I am going to upload another video for the particular Kibana dashboard. For this video that's all. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.